The 20th anniversary of Grand Theft Auto. Vice City is right around the corner, and since Grand Theft Auto 6 leaked online, people are anticipating Rockstar Games may show something on October 29th. Of course, nothing has been confirmed so far, but the leaks have most likely forced Rockstar to create a new development schedule. Everything is on the table from updated police AI to new characters or maybe even that shiny El Camino, although at this stage, anything is possible. The team behind GTA 6 could already have something planned for the anniversary, and looking at the leaked footage might reveal some clues. The gameplay leaks for Grand Theft Auto 6 are unfortunate, both for the passionate developers working on the project and the excited players who see a rough version of a game potentially years away from release. Although the game is in a very early stage of development, the leaks have shown off over an hour of gameplay features for Grand Theft Auto 6, including a return to Vice City, the internet playing a larger role, and the confirmation that Grand Theft Auto 6 will star two main Bonnie and Clyde-style characters. If nothing else, the 20th anniversary of Vice City could hopefully show new cover art and a brief look at the remodeled city and the characters players will encounter within it. Vice City's 20th anniversary is the perfect place to properly reveal GTA 6 Vice City content and give Rockstar a chance to launch the game's marketing campaign. Vice City has never been shown in a modern-day setting, so a reveal trailer exhibiting how it retains its identity in the present day would be a great starting point. It's a chance for developers to showcase a city that's grown since the days of Tommy Versetti and Lance Vance. Vice City is an enticing location filled with potential to build off the foundation laid by Grand Theft Auto. Vice City. It's possible the next GTA could include locations around Vice City as well, like a fictionalized Everglades, the neighboring islands of Key West, or even a mission at Cape Canaveral, allowing players to finally steal a space shuttle. Alongside GTA 6's modern Florida setting, the internet appears to play a larger role with distinctive messages popping up in the leaks. The modern-day Vice City could be a digital mecca, creating a variety of new gameplay features revolving around the gig economy, maybe crime is outsourced now in Grand Theft Auto. Vice City's 20th anniversary is the right time to reveal GTA 6 along with a new and improved Vice City, the 20th anniversary could be a big reveal that shows enough gameplay to tide players over until the game's official release, which is still expected to be quite a ways off. Looking at the leaks, it appears Grand Theft Auto 6's police AI will receive substantial improvements. Footage of GTA 6's two main characters robbing a restaurant in the same manner as Pulp Fiction shows a time until cops arrive meter slowly going down. Once the meter filled, police surrounded the store and the wanted level in the corner of the screen updated as the player stole a car with the message, any vehicle you are seen entering will be known to the law. The cops play a huge role in Grand Theft Auto, so seeing this kind of attention to making police more formidable for the player is always welcome. Beyond the cops, if store robberies are this detailed across the entire city, the 20th anniversary would be an ideal time to show gameplay involving a robbery for Grand Theft Auto 6's debut. GTA Vice City's fictionalized Miami Beach was a jump in quality for Rockstar's flagship series, and GTA 6 might be an attempt to make another grand leap. At a minimum, Vice City's 20th anniversary will hopefully result in something. The game already leaked, so hopefully Rockstar is prepared to reveal GTA during the celebration anyway. It's possible a lot of unknown features could take center stage if anything is revealed, but with a game as highly anticipated as Grand Theft Auto 6, Vice City's 20th anniversary looks like a good place to start.